In this video tutorial, we're going to we're going to talk about how to create center marks in circles. Um, when you open AutoCAD and create a center mark, it defaults to a center mark that is not industry standard. It's the center mark that has a little tiny X in the center of the circle. Um, that is not really how we want to do them. We want to create our circles to be industry standard. So uh, while we're looking at this, while you're looking at this video. If you open up your box.com center marks PDF, it will show you an incorrect center mark, the way AutoCAD does it out of the box, so to speak. But then it gives you a, uh, a list of commands that will help you create a center mark that is industry standard. And it's under the portion in the PDF called setting the value. So looking at AutoCAD now, we have a circle here. The first thing it says we need to do is use the list command and figure out what the radius of that circle is. And it says the radius of the circle is 1.32. So I'm going to type CAL, which is the calculator, 1.32 divided by, and if you look in number 7, it says divide the radius of the circle by 7. So I'll hit that and hit enter. And it gives me a number of 0.188. That's close enough. So I'll type in this. The third step is to type DIM sin. D-I-M-C-E-N, and type in that point one eight eight as a negative number, negative point one eight eight, and hit enter. Then the last thing it says to type the dim center command, and it'll go touch the circle, and it works perfectly. So let's go through that again. First, we determine the radius of the circle by using the list command. Second, we divide the radius of the circle by seven using the calculator option or CAL and we turn that into a negative number. And then we type the command dim sin, D-I-M-C-E-N, and we enter that negative number. And then we type the dim center command and touch the circle. 